Hello, this is Leila from Radakat. In this video, I'm going to have an overview on form recognizer. Uh, we have three types of the action that we can do with form recognizer. So the first one that is about uh, checking the layout. So we able using the KPI, we able to detect text table inside the form and the checkbox and some other objects. Uh, in the second phase is actually we able to use uh, the pre-built model and and we actually get, in, we get information from IDs, from invoices, from receipts, and uh, some of the uh, kind of the key value from this. Uh, and the last one that is a custom one, that is means that you actually, you can train based on the data that you have. So you can train your model based on the specific form that you have and actually use it. So in this scenario, first, I'm going just to show you that how it's work. And in future, we're going to custom and some more uh, features that form recognizer has. <music> So these are the website of the, if you search for form recognizer on Microsoft Azure, you should see some of the example over here, but I want to try. So at the bottom of the page, there is a key that is, you can say, try it out. Uh, when you click on that is actually, you should see that there are different options that you can try. You can, it's uh, one of the option to read the, just a plain, uh, the image and extract the text from that, uh, extract the checkbox and documents and the rest. So let's uh, start that one. So I'm going to click on read and I'm click on analyze. So uh, I didn't set up any resource. So I'm going to actually create a resource on my Microsoft one. So I'm going to create a resource from here and I call it form recognizer, Layla. I choose Australia East, price entire free. And so it's going to create a resource on my Microsoft Azure uh, on form recognizer. So if you go to your uh, 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 Microsoft Azure, you will see that this one is created. So this is a very simple one. So that means that you can analyze. Uh, these are some samples that we are going to see. So it's actually extract the simple text. If you're interested, you can add your own picture over here that's actually help you to extract that. I'm going to show you one. So click on add. And I have a document over here that I'm going to add over here. So that's an image that I have. And I'm going to see that how it works. So that's actually a so you see that is able to extract. So this is an image and all of these item has been extracted over here. So this is a very simple one. Now let's look at the other that is actually able to extract table, checkbox and ticks. So here is an example that they have. So uh, I'm going first to show you that one. So as you can see, it's able to uh, extract the text, but beside that you can see there is a table icon over here or over here that's actually able to extract the table. If you want to see the uh, JSON, because that's an API, so if you want to see the result of the in the JSON code, so you can see over here, also you can access to the code in Python to extract the information over there. So that's actually how it works. Again, same as other one, you can add your own data over here. So I'm going, for example, to add, uh, that's a ticket I have. Uh, I'm going to analyze that one. And as you can see, is able to detect the uh, table style over here. Still not all, for example, this because it has a header is able to detect, but this one because doesn't have is not able to recognize. Uh, also is able to, uh, as you can see, there's a different layers. If there is a selection mark, a table and text is able to detect. Uh, there are some other general documents and also invoices that you can actually use. So 
for the invoices it can be a pdf and you're able to actually to analyze that one so this is very specific one as a pre-built one that actually able to detect all of the item as a separate one over here again you can try it with the invoice that you have i'm not sure i have a, a one ready over here uh, but definitely it's work if you have a, a proper invoice over there so you can try it out uh, i can show you the business card one so i'm going to add my business card so this is the one that exists here and you can see the layout is not exactly straight but is able to detect the address and the other i'm going to add my own business card over here so going to add that one so this is my business card i'm just going to rotate it over here and then i'm going to analyze so uh, that's my kind of the old business card so as you can see is able to detect the company name um, so email job title uh, and website and some other information over here and definitely you can embed this one inside other application and also this is uh, these are the pre-built ones so these are the document analysis that we have that able to detect the layout you uh, for the identity also you can use that one health insurance vaccination card and the last one is a custom model that in next video i'm going to talk about that and how you can use it so uh, in summary if i want to uh, summarize you see that we have a setup for the layout so we're able to detect it extract the text documents uh, like table checkbox in there there is a custom one that you can use and uh, there's a pre-built one and the last one is custom one that in next video i'm going more deep on that also in next videos i'm going to show you how you can embed it in the in some of applications thanks so much for watching this video